Hello, hello, Cancer, and welcome into Speak Life. My name is Mia. Today is August 18th, and we're going to see what daily messages come in for you today, Cancer. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please, Universal Energies, Spirit Guides, Ancestors, please bring in any messages for Cancer. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please, Universal Energy, Spirit Guides, and Ancestors. One more. One more card for the outcome for Cancer. Cancer. Please, Universal Energies. Beautiful. I'm going to tell you right now, I'm hoping that this is a good reading. Cancer, you open up the reading with the chariot. Okay, this is someone moving away, someone moving on. This is could be you moving on. This could be somebody left and moved on. Somebody is moving. However, I feel that, listen, for some of you, you're going to move on with your life. Why? Because, listen, a cycle is done. When the world shows up, you should be celebrating, not looking to go back. Okay? You should be celebrating your life. It is time to move forward. It is time to elevate. It is time to complete the cycle with success. This is completing a cycle. Some of you cancers have recently done that. And you decided that you were going to take a, a journey, a small journey somewhere. But let me tell you something. Somebody here has no plans on coming back. Um, you also have the Queen of Wands. So with the Queen of Wands, listen, some of you are going to take care of yourselves, okay? Some of you are realizing that, listen, this is a woman who nurtures herself, okay? And let me tell you something. There is absolutely nothing wrong with a woman who nurtures herself. You need to nurture yourself before you can nurture anybody else. You can't give away your 10% while you giving away your 90 It doesn't work that way. You need to love yourself first. And then when you are in a situation where you can love the world, it will happen for you, Cancer. Why is the chariot here for Cancer? Please, Universal Energy, Spirit Guides, Ancestors, why is the chariot here? Moving forward. Some of you cancers, listen, you're moving forward. You get it not once, but twice. Six of rods, moving up with pride, okay? Some of you, listen, you're going to elevate yourself. This is moving away, moving away, stepping up, moving away. Do it. Do it if you must. It is the only way sometimes. Listen. You're going to have some money coming in regardless of whatever you do. Why? Because, listen, you're working hard on yourself. Some of you are in a situation where you have worked yourself off. Maybe, I read, for the last eight years, you could have been working on a situation financially. And let me tell you something. You're really not going to need anybody to come and help you pay bills. Okay, once you get to the Ten of Pentacles, you're not going to need anybody to come and help you pay bills. Okay, some of you are going to do this on your own. Oh, Lord, look at this. Two chariots. Now you have two. You have two. And I'm moving away. This is leaving. Some of you are leaving. Some of you may be taking a trip somewhere. Okay, some of you may be taking a mini vacation. Problem is, some of you will not be coming back. Why is the chariot here twice? Why is the chariot here twice for cancer? Wow. Listen, you're going to learn something. You're going to learn something that is, is going to make you not want to stay where you are. The truth is going to be revealed about someone. You're going to finally see the clarity that you need to make a decision. Some of you have not made a decision because you had not gotten clarity. But for some of you, you already got the clarity and you already decided, listen, you know what? I'm done with this. I'm moving on with my life, moving on with my pride, and I'm making my own money. Why is the queen of wands here? 
Why is the Queen of Wands here for Cancer? Please, Universal Energy, Spirit Guides, and Ancestors. And Ancestors. Why is the Queen of Wands here for Cancer? Sun, Moon Rising, and Venus. Please, Universal Energy, Spirit Guides, Ancestors. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> I love this. Listen, remember when I said you're not going to need anybody to take care of you financially? And I said you were at the eight of pentacles. Maybe you have worked in a certain field for eight years. Well, guess what? This is where you're going to end up. You're going to end up with the ten of pentacles. Okay, this is a family. This could potentially be a lot of money, okay? Some of you are going to be extremely successful in what you do, okay? And let me tell you something. If you are a woman who takes care of herself and on top of that, you, are, you have the abundance and the independence to do what you want in the world and select the people who, who are going to be part of your life. Listen, there's nothing more beautiful than that. Okay, but some of you listen, there's something that's going to come there's there's something that's going to come to you whether it's the truth, whether it's you learning something about someone. Listen, healing is going to be required. Everybody needs a healing period period. Um for those of you that stepped up and out of this relationship, okay? Somebody here is going to need some kind of healing. This is looking for light at the end of the tunnel potentially after you have learned something about someone. Why? I'm going to go back to the chariot because I can do that. Why is the chariot here? I want to see, feel, and hear something else for the chariot. Why is the chariot here for cancer? Cancer. one well two of them two of them listen you get the wheel of fortune some of you listen your destiny has just changed i'm gonna tell you right now some of you your destiny is here it's gonna change something is going to interrupt your road and you're not gonna be able to get to where you think you're gonna you were going um, you also have here the Empress. Listen, some of you are really, really nursing yourselves, really nursing yourselves, okay? If you are healing, okay, um, you know, with the Empress, um, I feel that for some of you, you may be healing a situation where you're finally accepting some things about your life. I also feel that for some of you, listen, this can also be a pregnancy card, okay? So for some of you, listen, Maybe not now, but maybe in the near future, maybe you might be having a child, you know, because after all, this is the empress. This woman is a woman who nurtures things. She puts things into her womb. She takes care of them. It's just like, you know, like when you, you were asked in, in the fourth grade, you know, to take an egg around for three days and, you know, you broke the egg. This woman does not break the egg. Okay, she takes something, puts it safely in her womb, and she nurtures it to fruition. For some of you, listen, this is going to be a baby. For some of you, it is going to be that you are finally going to heal from this situation and you are going to step up so victoriously that no one is going to be able to touch you, Cancer. Thank you so much for being here. I hope that this was able to give you some kind of clarity, Cancer, and take care.